is up everybody? How you all doing? I think I have here the coolest product I've ever reviewed on this channel. And I am super excited to review this for you guys. So this channel is mainly known for robot vacuums. Well, how about a robot lawnmower? Think about a robot vacuum, but outside. This has smart GPS built into it. So it'll basically mow your lawn as you see a robot vacuum will. And this one also is guided by GPS. Almost all robot lawnmowers out there right now, you have to lay down a guide wire and the robot will follow its own path based off that guide wire. So you have to put that around the whole perimeter of your yard and then it'll cut within that yard. On top of that, most of them are random to where they just kind of bounce around the yard until it hits that guide wire and then it'll keep going around the yard and not effectively cutting the entire yard. So this one is brand new. It is made by Mammotion. The model is the Luba All-Wheel Drive 3000. So you can see it's perimeter wire free, works off GPS, has a lot of things going for it. This is going to be an unboxing video and I'm going to quickly throw out all the information. All the information you do here on this video I will be covering completely in my review videos. I'm sure I'll have several videos out on this and I'm very excited to get this going. I have a pretty good sized yard too, probably about three quarters of an acre lot. So large yard, this one should tackle with no problem. Um, they do have three different versions out. So let me go over some specs real quick for this and then we'll unbox it and see exactly what you get. So once again, the biggest thing, no perimeter wire, which is awesome. This particular model can mow up to 0.75 of an acre, all wheel drive, and it can climb up to 65% slope or 33 degrees. There's an app you have to download that you can manage this. It has obstacle avoidance, which is really nice. So say you have a garden gnome or a bird bath in the middle of your yard, this will completely avoid that. It has automatic recharge. so it goes out to start the job and the battery is just not charged enough to get the job fully done. It'll come back, recharge, and then go back out and finish the job for you. You can set your own virtual boundaries. It has multi-zone management. So you can go tell it to clean your backyard or just your front yard or just your side yard or any really, really anywhere you want via the app. This particular model has the 10 amp hour battery. So once again, this is all wheel drive and each wheel has its own motor. It has a 400 millimeter cutting width and it can even maneuver uneven terrains with no problem. Let's quickly talk about the GPS that this has built inside. It also comes with an antenna that you have to install, which I'll show you when I do the review. So the RTK antenna has access to four global navigation systems and IMU sensors, given a precise positioning. The RTK signal can cover up to 45,000 meters squared. All right, a couple other specs real quick. Cutting height of this could be 30 to 70 millimeters. It is IPX6 waterproof, and this is made for thick grass and tough terrain. And the size of the actual robot lawnmower is 70 centimeters by 53 centimeters wide by 25 centimeters high. All right, let's go ahead and set you up, and we will open this up and see exactly what you get. Very excited for this. If you have any questions, please let me know down below. I'll try to answer them for you. Or if you want to see specific tests, I'll try to make that happen as well. If you guys could do me a big favor, hit that thumbs up for me, and consider subscribing, because I will have a lot of content on this. And I think I have the perfect yard for this, so hopefully it does what it says and is a great robotic lawnmower. All righty, here is everything included in the box. I'll go through it one by one and explain to you what it is. And then I'll lay it all out on this table and we'll go over it. Of course you get the manual, quick start guide. Here are the mounting poles for the RTK antenna. I'll show you how to put it together and where I install it and all that in the review. Here is an antenna. So on the top we have accessory kit C. Let's see what's inside of here. This is gonna be the yardstick to put down the pole for the RTK antenna. All right, here's this part. You put this on the front of the robot. This is a bumper bar. Here is part of the antenna. And 
I'm gonna go ahead and pull out all the rest of these boxes on the robot and set it down. Then we'll go through and show you everything that's in these other boxes. All right guys, got everything out of the box. A lot of stuff, so I'm gonna take some of this off this desk and then once again show you the robot and everything in these boxes to the right. So this is the dock. This is how it goes back and recharges. This is charging contacts. This is how it knows where to go and pull itself into the dock to recharge. Back here, of course, is the plugs and everything. And it's got a nice, good feel to it. Feels like real sturdy, thick plastic, so it should last a long time. So this here is to help install the antenna. It's gonna click into this, or you put a few screws into it anyway. That's how it's gonna to attach to the pole as you tighten this. Accessory kit A, let's go to see what's in here. A little Allen wrench. A few stakes to help hold down the base. All right, I went ahead and just took everything out of the box to make this a little bit quicker and easier. Here is the main battery charger. So you plug this portion, of course, into your wall. And this just connects to different adapters. That comes with plenty of different power cables to send power to the base, of course. Nice and long. I'm not sure exactly how long this is, but I'll let you know in the review. And of course, you get plenty of mounting hardware and everything you need to install it, of course. So let's go ahead and get rid of all this and we'll go over the robot itself. All right, now on to what everybody really cares about, the robot lawnmower itself. Very, very heavy in a good way. It means it's going to be very good build quality. Here is the front bumper. Once again, it could be driving. It'll bump into it. This is going to depress, telling it to watch out. There's something in its way, of course. And to install that, it's simply just plug and play. So these front wheels are omnidirectional. You got these spinning wheels basically on it that makes it a lot easier to turn and maneuver. There are some sensors in front here, four of them. And I'll go over more of the technical stuff in the review as I do it. You got some very nice tires on the back, nice and thick. It's got some real deep ridges. So it's gonna be able to go through the yard and get up those steep hills with no problem. Once again, nice and thick rubber, heavy duty. Has a emergency stop button in case it just won't stop on its own or a kid's on the way or, or something is on the way that you, of course, don't want it to hit. It also has some side bumpers. Here's the back for your charging, of course. Your SIM, a USB, and then this port as well, which I'll let you know in the review. Here is the bottom of the unit. So it uses eight razor blades, two different spinning rotators. And as these spin, these blades will go out and stay out, basically, for a momentum. Definitely feels like a nice, high-quality build. A lot of metal. Looks like they're using aluminum as well. And once again, the tires are very impressive. Very, very thick rubber. And there's also some shocks up front. So very cool, definitely feels like a tank. Very, very high quality from what I can see off first impression. I really, really hope this does a great job. That's gonna wrap up this unboxing video. Once again, in my review and future videos, I'll go over much more detailed, a lot more technical information. I have lots of videos on how everything works individually and all together. And uh, I think it's going to be really good. I'm really excited to see how well this guy does. Yeah, do me that favor. Thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe on your way out. If you have any questions whatsoever, please let me know down in the comments. Thanks so much for watching this video. Definitely stay tuned for the rest of the videos on this. Have a great day. See ya.